are lots of microphones out there in the world in 2014, but you aren't sure which one to buy? That's what this mobile gadget video is about. I'm Andrew from Mobile Gadget, and let's take a closer look at the blue snowball. Now before we get started, you need to ask yourself what you want a microphone for. If you're going to be using your mic for filming behind a green screen or with a DSLR, you probably want to use a shotgun microphone. However, if you're doing music videos or concerts, you should choose a Levlier type microphone. Or however you pronounce Levlier. However, if neither of those categories fit your needs, then this microphone is probably going to be for you. For its class, the Blue Snowball blows any built-in microphone of any computer out of the water, period. Now, for this microphone, it is meant to be plugged in through USB, and it really is meant to record voiceovers, music, and podcasts and live streams. But moving on, this mic has three modes. One, for single voiceovers, which is what we're using now, and in our YouTube videos. The second is if you're trying to record music, like your son or daughter playing the piano, or if you're making a YouTube video with music. Finally, you have your third option. You want to use this if you're recording a podcast or a live stream with more than one person, as this mic can record to both sides around the microphone. But in case you were wondering the technical terms, one is cardioid, two is padded cardioid, and three is omnidirectional. Another nice feature with the Blue Snowball is its design. In my opinion, it looks very premium and looks very professional. It also has a tripod-like base to hold it up and keep it steady, which surprisingly works very well. The legs move to get the right angle, and you'll notice that you can take the actual ball off the base, even though you're not supposed to do this. You can also put it on a boom pole. If you wanted to use this with your camera, however, you're gonna need to, it's gonna take some work because it's not as easy as just plugging it in and letting it work. The mic is also very light and portable if you're moving around a lot, which I really enjoy. Personally, I move around a lot too, and if you, then this is definitely a good choice. Now that you know a little bit about the Blue Snowball, let's actually listen to some sounds. Here, so let's give it a try. Here's number two. Here's number three. We're on the microphone and it's picking me up pretty well. As you can see, it's picking me up pretty well. And the reason I didn't do number one is because I'm already talking in number one so you know how I sound. So you don't need to worry about that. If you like that, if you like the way this sounds, then you might want to go with this. You already know how the mic works, you know how it sounds. So this microphone comes in multiple colors, around $50, which is really bang for your buck microphone. I found mine at Best Buy for around $60, but of course it's going to be much cheaper on Amazon. I would rate this mic a 9 out of 10. It's very versatile and well designed by Blue. It also sounds very, very good for the price. Now the only reason I didn't give it a 10 out of 10 is because there's always room for improvement. However, if you're looking for a little bit better quality sound and some extra features, you might want to check out the Blue Yeti, which I'll leave a link in the description. Anyway, thanks for watching our review on the Blue Snowball. Thanks for watching, and if you like videos like this, please subscribe as it helps us out so much and make more content for you. Tell me in the comments if you plan on getting this mic. See you in the next one.